Okay, shall we uh, discuss the questions? What is the first question? Okay, this is uh, uh, discussing about sales tax questions, right? So, what is the first question? Can you read out for me? Yeah. What is the list price? Six hundred. So, sales uh, list price, right? So, what does it mean? List price six hundred means. List price, what does it mean? Is it uh, inclusive of tax or excluding tax? Excluding. Excluding tax, okay. So what is the sales tax rate? How much is that? It's mentioned 5% of normal list price, but the question is if sales tax is charged on 15%. What is 5%? The trade discount. Ah, okay. So now they have given a trade discount of 5% on the list price. Okay. Now on this 6%, if you did a 5% uh, trade discount, how much is that? How much is that 5% on 600? 30. No, no, 5% are 30. Okay. So that is the discount. So what is the list price after the discount? 570. 570. So how much has been charged as uh, sales tax? 15%. 15%. So how much is that? 85.5. 85.5. So what will be the total value of the sales, including tax? Which is going to be 655.5. Correct? So this is the answer for the first part. So shall we go to the second part? Read the question. At 1st December 2025, the sales tax authorities 23,778 during the month of December Lori recorded the following transactions. Sales of 800,000 exclusive of 17.5% sales tax. Mm -hmm. Purchases 590,790 5, inclusive of sales tax of 17.5%. Okay, so what is the sales tax uh, account? Sales tax account, how much is the balance? Opening balance? 23,778. 23,778. 778. So this is payable to the tax authority, right? This is the opening balance. Okay, this is payable to tax authorities. Now during the period, how much is the sales value? 800,000. Sales value is how much? 800,000. Which is including tax or excluding tax? Excluding. It says excluding. So what is the sales tax percentage? 17.5. 17.5. So how much is the tax portion? If you calculate 840,000. 840,000. So this 140,000 is payable. To the tax authorities, huh? we are collecting from the, the final consumers of the goods, and this amount will be remitted to the tax authority. So it's a payable, it's a liability. So 140,000 will be credited to the sales tax account on sales. What else? Purchases. So purchases, how much? 590,790. 790. Is this including tax or excluding? including tax right so which means this 590 includes the tax portion yeah okay so therefore you can't calculate trade away 17.5 on this so what you need to do you need to divide this by 117.5 okay because this is inclusive of tax so you need to identify uh, the tax paid on your purchases how much 87 990. Okay. So this is this amount can be recovered, you know. This will be refunded. So refunded means a receivable amount. So therefore the sales tax account you can debit 87,990. Okay, this is on your purchases. Now what is the total amount to be paid to the tax authority? 75788. 
So this is the balance carrying forward. Okay. Who this checks? Who checks? What? Is it good? Yeah, seventy five, seven, seven, eight. Ah, oh, you know. Seventy five, seven, double eight, right? So this is the answer. Okay. So let's move on to the the other question. So third question, what is that? In the quarter ended thirty first March twenty twenty, Charlie had taxable sales. Mm. Net of sales tax of nine thousand and yes. taxable purchases of seventy two thousand. Sales net of tax, right? How much? Sales tax. Yes. Uh, net of sales tax. Ninety thousand. Ninety thousand. Then. Purchases seventy two thousand net of net of sales tax right yeah seventy how much two thousand seventy two thousand so what does this mean net of sales tax net of sales tax okay you are adding the tax mm. so which means sales net of sales tax mm. means this ninety thousand is excluding the taxes mm. this is the gross amount. So this is your gross sales. You are adding the sales tax, net sales. Okay. So uh, what is the uh, tax amount? How much 10%. is that? Huh? Ten percent. Ten percent. So it's straightforward. Nine thousand is the payable output tax, and uh, receivable or the input tax is seventy-two thousand. This also net of sales tax. Mm. So which means seventy-two thousand is uh, gross purchases. Okay. On this ten percent will be how much? Seven thousand two hundred. So how much is that? One thousand eight hundred is receivable or payable? No, payable. Why payable? Because it's on sales, right? Yeah, your output back. This is your output back, no? This is yeah. output. Yeah. Why we say output? This is input. Why output? Because, Because whatever the taxes we collect from the consumers. We have to remit to the tax authority. So this is the remittance. The amount that has to be paid to the tax authorities uh, higher than the the amount that you can recover. Mm. Okay. So this is payable. This is receivable. Mm. So they have a one thousand eight hundred is payable. Yeah. So this is the payable amount. Is that clear? Mm. Okay. So let's move on to the other question. Okay, read, read. A summary of the transactions of Ramsgate Co., which is registered to account for sales tax of seventeen point five percent in mm. all transactions, mm. shows the following for the month of August two thousand and twenty-nine: mm. outputs sixty thousand, exclusive of tax; inputs forty thousand two hundred eighty-six. Output uh, exclusive sixty thousand. Output is sixty thousand, exclusive of sales tax. And input forty thousand two eighty six. Forty thousand two eighty six. Forty thousand two eighty six. Okay. So what is output? What is input? Sales and purchases. Yeah. This is sales, right? Now here you are given as output. Yeah. And your input is how much? Forty thousand. That is your purchases. Mm. Right. Yeah. Now we are saying output of sixty thousand is. Yeah. What exclusive of tax. tax? So which means you need to calculate on that. Yeah. That's the gross amount, right? Mm. So seventeen point five and forty thousand two eighty six inclusive inclusive of tax. So therefore you can't apply seventeen point five straight away. So what you need to do? You need to divide this by what? One hundred seventeen point five. Why do we need to divide this by one hundred seventeen point five? Because it's It's inclusive. For example, let's say your gross sales is hundred. Okay. So when you add the sales tax hundred, sorry, seventeen point five, what is your inclusive price? Hundred seventeen point five. To calculate this, if you simply you if you take this as hundred, okay. So what you need to do is, sorry, if you take this as the total of hundred seventeen point five. So you need to divide this by 117.5 to calculate the sales tax. What you need to do? You have to multiply by 17.5. Okay. So how much is that? Calculate. 
60,000 times 17.5. How much? Balance carried forward amount. What is? Uh, 